So guys, Genesis 3 contains the detail of an event that has repeated itself numerous times throughout history. My name is Eunice and joining me in today's episode of Peace of Me Discussing is... Well, they say ladies first, so I will introduce myself. I am Abigail Osei and um, yeah, I have been invited by Eunice to join this uh, discussion panel, the Peace of Me. I'm excited to bring my peace of mind, what the Lord reveals to me concerning his word and yeah. Yeah, I'm Daniel Dacon. Uh a youth leader in uh, True, True Services Church in Arkham. Very well. Thank you for the introduction, guys. So today we are discussing why if gave a wrong information, a false information to the serpent when she was questioned. And what we want to look at is is it that just Adam failed to give her the like the accurate information, the right information that he received from God, or was Eva just some woman with a big mouth, too many words to to spare, and just like rubber out whatever she wanted to say? So exactly what is your thought on it? This is based on like Genesis three, two, and three. What do you say, guys? Okay, for me, I would say. Uh, Adam did well by teaching Eve the consequences of eating the tree of life because when she was tempted by the devil, she said, God said we should not. Remember, when Adam was created, Eve was not there. So for Eve to remember that God said, it means Adam had passed that information to her that we should not eat the tree of life. Well, can I join in? Yes, well, please. Um, <laughs> <laughs> ah, we, we know how ladies we are. We know how we, we like to talk. You know, they say men are logic beings and we ladies are emotional beings. Okay, so when we are speaking, we are always adding a few more details into it. Mm -hmm. So I believe that's exactly what happened. All right? Because we read in the Bible, like you said, Adam was the one who received the divine instruction by God. It is found in Genesis chapter um, 2, verse 15. God told the man not to eat of the fruit. Mm -hmm. Now, we have to understand that the man was inside the man, right? That's what we know of the scriptures. But later down the line, God now puts Adam to sleep, takes the woman and creates her. So in my, um, in my opinion, right? Adam must have given the information to Eve, all right. But we say that when we are telling somebody something, right, some things get lost in translations real quick, okay? And so I will say two things. Women, we are more emotional and we add a little, a little sauce to the whole, the whole story. Yeah. And also a lot got, my opinion, lost in translation. Um, let's just take a look at the verse 2. Um, and the woman said to the serpent, we may eat fruit from the tree. I'm reading from the Amplified version of the garden, verse three. And here is where we have to pay attention to accept the fruit from the tree, which is in the middle of the garden. God said, you should not eat from it, nor touch it. Otherwise you will die. So I want to pull our attention on this part except from the tree which is in the middle of the garden which means when we are saying that according to what our brother daniel said earlier that um adam gave all the information out then it will mean that maybe eve forgot the name of the tree because from here we can see that she doesn't even know the name of the tree she just said the tree in the middle of the garden so is something missing here you know the way God created things. You know, I've lived, I've lived in rural areas before, and sometimes you can give somebody a description that under that tree near the junction, mm -hmm. you have not been there before. But due to the description, 
you can imagine that so immediately you get there you will know that it is that tree at the junction but we shouldn't forget in the garden of eden this tree was specially made in the middle of it was it was a special he said how could Eve know that all this except the one in the middle i believe adam went there with her and showed mm-hmm. her the tree yeah so she knew the tree you knew she knew the tree okay so you were saying that she knew the name of the tree but she was just referring it, it as be in the middle of the garden that, yeah. when adam was giving out the information to eve he probably took her to where the tree is and he was like okay so we can eat from all these trees but you know that one in the middle we are not supposed to eat of it and i think it will be it will be better if you don't even touch it because you might die maybe that was the information given out what do you think don't you think maybe adam just like it better not to touch it let me tell her not to touch it before she go touch it so <laughs> Amy, don't you think maybe that was like how the information was given over i could understand or i could imagine that being the source of the false information okay <laughs> now what you said it could be it could be it could be definitely um but i think important reading and studying the bible is always uh, uh context right reading what the, the previous chapter says and then what the next chapter says right mm-hmm. and it's really important to understand that my bible i'm reading from the new king james version right uh-huh. <laughs> and so the new king james version says in um genesis chapter 2 verse 9 and out of the tree yeah verse 9 and out of the tree the lord god made every tree grow that is pleasant to the sight and good for food the tree of life was also was also in the midst of the garden uh-huh okay so my as my bible just lets me understand that listen what eve is saying um, that the tree of life in the midst of the garden is totally right because yeah. because the, the bible clearly states that the tree was in the midst of the garden yeah right and for something to be in the midst i mean god does everything well he does everything with intention <laughs> we know how to, i don't know if you are parents or not but i'm not yet a mother but with my younger siblings i have noticed when he, you know when something is like dangling before their eyes right it's just i don't know if, if something is shining is in the midst of the living room let's just say in the midst of the living room right they like they are, they are attracted to it in a certain way right and so you know they, they kind of play with it and you tell them don't touch it don't touch it you know those with children you understand them so god placing i think the real question is why did god place that tree in the midst of the garden because we know that the bible does not mention anything just to mention it for fun yeah. we know that yeah. the bible is very intentional in other words the holy spirit is very intentional okay yep, yep. so that is like i said if what she said is true she just she just given uh what the bible already described about the tree right but the, the only interesting part is when god was you know god created the eat the, the the garden of eden he was nowhere to be found she was hidden in adam her husband yeah. right and so definitely when she came out and exploring you know the the, the garden is beautiful exactly. Uh, rivers and everything. exactly she saw that the tree is indeed in the midst so it's in the midst of the garden and it's in the midst of the garden that is my point <laughs> yeah so um you 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 are saying that it was just um uh, eve just giving some souls to the whole story to make it interesting exactly. Exactly. to you know to underline the fact that mm. if you touch mm-hmm. it if you yeah. eat it you would yeah. die so it was just exactly. some sauce being added mm. to the whole mm. thing okay the yeah, little sense. sauce yes <laughs> <laughs> so it was some sauce being added to it so we we are agreeing on this one here that um adam gave the information out all right Eve understood 
everything all right but when she was asked by the serpent that are you surely not supposed to eat of all these trees and that is the topic we'll be coming to in another episode what the words that the devil was using to kind of mm-hmm. trip her, to kind of yeah. get her attention to yeah. something very juicy that he was about to do um mm-hmm. then it was just like eve trying to like make a statement here uh, 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 uh.